Hello everybody and welcome once again to Galactic Science 2. At the end of the last episode we had made a, a couple of things didn't we? We made the the Workbench Plus and we also made, um, what else do we make? The Metal Former. So we're actually making some metal plates. Let's go and have a look at how they're getting on. Actually, we nearly got those. <coughs> they might as well wait for the others to finish. Only 14 to go. And then we might be able to add an overclocker or something like that to it. Now, what else have we got to do in this quest line? Let's have a look. So, I don't want that one. Actually, maybe I do. So, we've got this license to plate. We had this slicey. And slicey is a block cutting machine. So, the recipe for block cutting machine try cutting is this one <coughs> and we require 10 enduring processes which we've got no chance of doing until we've been to Mars because then we can get the oh, um, sag mill so that's that one the other one was Ignis extruder wasn't it this one now that we can do and it might be worth doing that now <coughs> I don't well to manage with it I don't really think it is but it will complete a quest the reason I don't think it is because I think it doesn't work as the same as on normal. So let's have a look. So we needed 10 blocks of iron and 10 blocks of redstone, didn't we? And 10 blocks of redstone. It was 11. And the redstone reception coils, that was one of those. Oh, there's two of those, and one piece of gold, isn't it? I think it's that way around. We'll make sure, just take a, one of. Can't go wrong if we put two pieces of gold. I think it's just two redstone. So, what I'm doing in here, I'm just making some more ender poles, of course, as we always need to do. So, if I put like that, we should be able to make our redstone reception coil. And if I put these in. I'm wondering, do we want to make a sterling generator? I think it's not a bad idea. But we'll leave that for the time being, unless it gets on to its ender pearl and then its redstone reception core. It'll do another ender pearl, which is great. It'll keep things charged up for us. So I'll put this stuff back. Let's go and have a look at this quest over here, see if that's nearly finished now, because that will actually make things a bit easier on this machine. Yes, we've got our stuff. So now we have to claim that reward. Done. This is this one. Detect submit. So we get an out one overclocking upgrade, which is claim. Done. So that then opens up these three. So we've got a metal machine hole, an iron machine hole, 64 of those, that's a lot. And we'll give us a loot chest in return. Or we've got dense refined iron plate. I've got a feeling we can't do that. So let's have a look. Dense refined iron plate. Let's have a look what the ingredients for those two things are. So we need a metal. It was an iron hole, wasn't it? Now we also could upgrade the other machine. I was going to make signal one, wasn't I? Now we've got the signal them um, this one this is what we have to do for that because it didn't work on the other one so it was 12 copper sil silver and iron oxide and we need four of those uh, oh let's put this in here that's the up upgrade increases the power but also reduces decreases the time by mills by 70 percent um and uh, what was the other one we needed? It was a machine frame, a hole, wasn't it? So an iron hole. So we need 32 dents iron, and that gives us one. And silicon plate. Silicon plate, strange enough, is just two silicon will give me one plate, so that's no big deal. Iron plate is we haven't got a compressor 
So we, do we need dense iron plate for this? Ah, we do. This is going to be really expensive. So let's look. Dense iron plate. Can we do a compressor? It'll be industrial craft, won't it? I'm not seeing it at the moment. So look. Implosion tech reborn, so it must be down here somewhere. strange I'll tell you what to do oops let's just do it like this what's that make a bat zapper <laughs> we got no recipe for this one an electric compressor we got no recipe for Implosion compressor, auto compression, gas turbine. That's a bit strange. I wonder if that's supposed to be like that. Can't be, can it? It must, it must have to be able to make a compressor. Have I spelt it wrong? There was an iron hole, iron machine hole, dense iron plate, compress or. Well, I don't see it. Well, that's a bit strange. We can't actually make a compressor. Maybe it's a reward. Hmm, okay. It's going to be tricky. But you never, the trouble is, you're never really 100% sure whether the things have been nerfed like a compressor or it's actually just broken recipe at the moment in the beta release which makes life a bit tricky at, at this stage of the game so anyway we wanted to make some signal and blend didn't we so we needed iron oxide which I think I don't see any here which is basically iron and oxygen and then we needed copper and silver copper and silver that'll do so let's take the recipe out of here and maybe I've got it already programmed in here let's have a look oh wrong way it's two crows yes this one is 21 and the next one is basically how many was it now for that I've forgotten already uh, brilliant let's have a look um, look for signal and blend because this is one where the duplicate receives 12 4 and 1 okay so 12 like that Four and one. Oh, that's A G or A U. Do I not have any A U in here? Maybe not actually. Let's go and get some A G's gold and A U silver, isn't it? Oh, we got 36 we only need probably just one ingot well that is a g wrong way around so it's gold I got that 
completely wrong. Oh, well, I've got to check this again. Thermal. This one. We could do it either way because they both got mixed recipes and the same. 12, 4, and 1 iron oxide. That is AG. That is silver. 12 copper, 4 silver, and 1. 12 copper, 4 silver, and 1. And it is not working. I, not, I haven't got this thing, stupid problem with the uh, empty yet. Maybe. Well, I don't know, because that worked before, didn't it? Gosh, this is a bit of a nuisance. 12 copper, 4 silver, and 1 iron oxide. 12, oh, carbon. Well, thanks. Um, <coughs> one. That was bright. Oh, now I'm getting in ingots. Okay, good. Five. Okay. Well, don't ask me. I'm confused and uh, being daft, of course. Well, yeah. I should put that in that machine as well, shouldn't I? So, um, right, we need one iron. We can make this. One signal and gear. That'll give us one of these. Um, boom, boom. In fact, let's go and have a look at that machine, see what state it's in. Alright, we've just got a little bit of water in there, we can don't mind about that too much, do we? So we can right, should be able to shift right click this now. Yep. And we should be able to upgrade this as well. So we come here. And we'll say the uses of this. So this is the one we should be able to do now. And there we get reinforced. Fantastic. And we should. I think probably should do that also on the same for the other one as well. The other machine that we've got that's a bit slow. So we can actually now put these back in again, and that one, and to get some water on it. So I'm curious to know how much faster it goes. I can walk through doorways, which I seem to have a problem with. That wrong one. Water. Oops, <laughs> very funny. So that's not running. It doesn't seem to be desperately fast, does it? But, oh, that's because I haven't added the, the speed augment in. Whoops. Augments. This one. This is the this is this this two one I think because it's speed. So if this makes it get a bit faster. Oh yes, that's definitely a lot faster now. And of course, it's going to run out of water fairly quickly. I really do want to find a bet a good way of getting water into here because I could put the tank on the top and that should work. But I think I just haven't got enough um, cabling. Might be good if I could reach actually. Let's have a look, see how much cabling we can actually man manage to bring across here. We've got 10. I want that, don't I? So, basically, all we need to do is to come from. come to here and then we can put the tank on top and it can feed down we've got one left and we're not going to have enough for that one are we no it's going to best that we can do is bring it around so we need one two three four five six seven I I think it might be possible if we do some end stone. 
So if we take, I've got that hopper with me, yes I have, okay. If we go down here, and remove this water from here actually, let's take the water out. that and we put in its place a hopper actually I could do with one more block couldn't I because well, maybe I can do it from here like that and put into that some glowstone now I've got to think I need to get another cache on lava the well, lava will still keep coming into here isn't it oh you know what the problem is going to be? I've run out of um, cobblestone. Okay. So let's go. While I'm here, let's just check this thing again. 2.5. It's no. It's not going up very very fast. Um. Lava. I want to get some cobblestone, don't I? take all of this I think what did I just bring down there Let's put what we don't want away I got plenty of lava in here as well I should take that out as well because I think it, oops just got two chests of this our oh, two tanks are full with lava so that's probably a good thing to do as well let's put the two tanks one here and one here and get those pushing onto this tank I think that should work actually push yeah that's working just fine and I need to make a cache because it's going to be it's going to fill up this with um, glowstone uh, end stone. Oh, that's okay that's probably okay let's get this one doing as well I'll be using this up fairly fast, so let's go over here. Fill up that with some cobble. I'm going to wait for this to give me a stack of uh, glowstone before we try to do anything else, maybe even two stacks. The reason we need those uh, end stones is we can then. We can't decompose. I don't think it's got any uses for decomposing. We'll have a look. Actually, I don't need these. I'm not going to put these back in the other chest. And I'll put this water back over there. And then what I would, should do... Nah, maybe I'll just do it like this. Use this chest downstairs. Because, of course, if I put the chest down here, I can still open it, which is great. And we, we get the end stone into there like that. And then we can put this more glowstone into there and over time that will start to fill up I should really be making some more um, I'll do that off camera anyway, some more crucibles to get that whole process going a little bit faster and we could do some automation on that we might be able to even do that so let's have a look at thinking about how we can do that before we actually try to progress with these quests and I also wanted to check the usage of this didn't I facade not very useful at the moment sky blocks shapeless crafting yep. pulverize it to crushed end stone that might be interesting what can we do chisel it decompose it so when we decompose this we get different things like silicon oxygen hydrogen beryllium lithium zirconium sodium rubicon gallium einsteinium we should also get some arsenide as well I think But some of these are radioactive. So what I'd like is the gallium on our side. Let me just go back. I don't know, I wanted to check the usage of the other one, didn't I? Uses of the pulverized endstone. This one here, crushed endstone, uses of that one. Nothing. Okay, good. And the reason we need the gallium arsenide is because we need um quartz this stuff 
we should easy to get if we could actually find some source of it but I don't know where we're going to get a source of this but we can here look you got silicon dioxide plus one gallium oxide will give me one of these unfortunately if I look here that's a quartz wrench which is five useful for use very useful as this one here we need three crushed certis quartz we could not be able to use certis quartz and glass well glass is no problem so look how we can get certis quartz by crushing that one and certis we can get by um so the recipe for that yeah we need stagmalate we can actually some aluminium and phosphate and 300 3 million rf aluminium phosphate and we can get it by decomposing aluminium phosphate how do we get phosphate so i'm actually curious about not too useful what's the piece for aluminium phosphate i've got Sorry, I wanted the phosphate, didn't I? What do we get? Phosphorus and oxygen, no big deal. Phosphorus, how do we get phosphorus from glowstone? Oh, okay. And that's 100% chance. Okay, so that's what we do with that. So I don't, I'm messing around with my endstone. Uh, endstone will be useful later on, I'm sure, but let's get on with that one. So maybe we can make a stick or stack or two of that. That'll give me 64, 128 phosphate. I'll just do one at the time being to decompose one of those. Oxygen, no problem. We've got plenty of oxygen around. I'll take some of this magnesium oxide, for example. Decompose that. And aluminium is also not in a shortage. So I think, is it just one of each? Probably not. Yeah, we're going to want a glowstone. Oops, four. Yep. Yeah. Four phosphate. Let's get rid of this carbon. Um, what I thought was copper. Can't read. It's sometimes it, I should notice it's blue rather than anything else, really, shouldn't I? those up there um, so we need more oxygen got a stack of oxygen up there we'll put these through here for starters oxygen that's 32 around go in the wrong place another stack of oxygen sixty three sixty four right put those two in there now we should be able to get two a stack of this phosphate so let's go carry on so that was basically this one wasn't it so it's quartz So we need aluminium and phosphate. So that's basically four, one aluminium and four of these, huh? Nope, one phosphate and one aluminium. So that's pretty good. We can get some surface quartz. Hopefully we can grind it. I didn't really check that very carefully, but you never know. So aluminium. So I'm going it because that's in. I think I told that to make some ingots, didn't I? 37 aluminium ingots. What are we doing over here? That's empty. Let's work on the next one. That's doing copper. But I might as well go to the quarry again in a short mi few minutes. Thirty-seven is actually going to give me. I need sixteen, I think, because sixteen will give me six, 
Six four stacks, won't it? Did I record phosphate? I didn't record phosphate in the book. I'm going to do that now. But I should also put glowstone in here because it's going to show me the, the recipe for that phosphate. We've got our aluminium. So now we can put our stack of that in there. Oh, I shout. I need one stack, didn't I? Because I've only got one stack of... Let's put a stack of that in there. So it was one of each, wasn't it? I might be in the wrong... Oh, no. Aluminium phosphate. So we get a stack of that. Let's put the aluminium away in here. We'll need that at some stage, I'm sure. Let's put that into the recipe book here. And the uses of that, I guess, are just one corner. Let's have a look. Nope. What am I doing wrong? That makes a, a cross. Is there any other recipes for that? No, there aren't. Just, we just get ground. So we're going to get 16 of these. Ah, oh, yeah, it uses 3 million RF a tick, so it takes, it's quite slow. What I could do to speed that up is that ah, I can't really. I'd have to move it. It's actually not a bad idea to move this, but I think I'll just leave it for the time being. How have we got now? 13. Got three more to go, basically. 16, yep. So. Having done that, oh, what I need to do is the quartz fibre, wasn't it? It's like this. So we've got those, no problem. So we just need some uh, obsidian now for glass. So we need six obsidian, and that'll make three quartz fibres. Hopefully we can do this. Let's have a look. I'm going to get 12. We'll de decompose that to silicon dioxide. And we'll make that silicon dioxide into glass. In fact, I'm going to put this into here as well, by the way. So we know what we're talking about. And I'm going to get the book and I'm going to take the glass out of here. We've got a recipe for glass. Oh, we haven't got a recipe for glass. Okay. Uh, I'm going to put it in because it's just a faff doing it each time, isn't it? Let's do four. We get a glass. Let's take that out. Let's put that into the book. You click shift click in the middle there and you get it, so that's no big deal. I'll leave that in there now. So we should have our four, st four stacks. Twelve. That's right. Three stacks. So we now got our twelve. So we can do this. Make some quartz fiber. And the uses of this, of course. Fluids crystals. I hope we can make a fluids crystal. We can possibly. Allium and hy hypophosphite. That's, that's not a problem. That's hydrogen, oxygen, phosphorus again. Two of those. And one in allium and phosphate. We've already got that. And gallium arsenide. That's the hard one. We can get it easily enough from moon surface rock. And quartz, of course, no, the quartz. How many do I need of these? I need two, don't I? So maybe I've got no choices. Chemical decomposing it. 
flutes, yeah, well, of course, anything with flutes seems going to be all right. Chiseled quartz, oh, yeah, fairly obvious, really. And anything that's already made out of... But these would be good. Anthracite, I don't think there's a recipe for anthracite. Detrite and colored cult and cobblestone. Detrite, you can yeah. See, that's a trouble. Everything's got quartz in it. Okay. I'm going to put those away for the time being and then we'll see if we can get some gallium arsenide from here. But before I do that, I'm going to make a leaded chest. So a leaded chest. Is this one. We get a reward for this, but we need one chest with eight lead. So we're going to do this because, well, this thing that we get, we get ra radioactive stuff out of here. Now, have I got any lead? Whoops. Molten lead bucket. Let's do that like that. Put molten lead bucket in here because that should not yet come out because it's bound to be yep yeah, ninety six, whatever. And here we get our stuff. Let's just take that out of there. Put the bucket back again. That's gone. Oh yeah, it's just going down. Good. So we just need eight. So that's half a half an ingot, which we can decompose. There we go, 16 of those, so we just need a chest. Chest, chest, chest. I don't know that I've got one made already. Yes, well, no, I don't. I have to make some more. I've already got two planks. I must have some wood. these. Yeah, made all the wood into planks, that's always clever. Forget shift clicking, that's a bad idea. I'll just put that in there, let's take one of those out of that. And we'll put this down over here. I'm going to put it in the corner actually, I think. For the time being, no, I'll put it over here. So let's go down our stairs and hope that we get some galleon arsite from this end zone that we've got here. Hopefully we've got by now two stacks. 63. Oh, I didn't put the other one in, huh? Oh, yes, I did. That's probably just still slowly making lava, huh? Yes, it is. I've still got some cobblestone. Well, actually, I'm going to make some more stacks of cobblestone while I'm here. So let's go and get out four. Let's get to eight. Oops. In fact, I'm going to call it a day because uh, my oxygen is very low and I'm going to replenish that. And I'm going to do this and come back and see you, see you next time. So until then, bye for now.